and I promise you that this week I'm just trying to jump in every day. And today's message is I had an aha moment. I had that moment with myself that I realized I am not fully jumping into what I committed to. So today I said no more, no more excuses for myself. Um, I'm gonna make time for the things that are most important and everybody has 24 hours in a day. So if there's something in your life that you wanna do better, be better, today's the day. So today's Just Jump In is dedicated to decide, commit, succeed. And succeeding doesn't mean everything is perfect. Succeeding means that you push through the hard times. So pushing through the hard times and say, um, maybe in your health and wellness, pushing through the hard times in your business, pushing through the hard times in relationships, all of it, all of it takes hard work. Pushing through hard times in your faith in God, trusting that He is with you in all things, through all things, not giving up. So today's dedication, just jump in, decide, succeed. job to make it happen. You might have to cut back on a job to 
to make it happen. But today, I want you to stop making excuses. I did. And I want to thank my coach, Kyla, today for kind of flipping it on me and helping me see what was going on and where I needed to push. Thanks for believing in me, girl, when um, I was starting to not believe in me. And so today, I want to push that forward to you. Say, I'm here for you. I want to believe in you too. I'm here to help support you. And uh, if that's a prayer, if that's a quick copy or a phone call, or if you want to come and do this with me, I've had other people message me, they want to jump in because they want to just like kind of have this little moment with themselves and let go. So um, today is decide, commit, succeed. And I'm here to do it with you. And my other favorite thing to say is let go and let God. And so in all things, I'm going to say that I've come this far in my life to this very, very place that I always come and jump in, which is by the water tower. I'll show you. It's by the water tower, Anderson Street. And when my dad died, I came here and I spent so much time um, fasting, praying, reading God's word, and getting stronger in my faith when I was 16 and 17. And um, this is a special place. And so I, just, I always like to share it with you guys, and that's why I started the jump in a long time ago. Um, I started it because everyone was scared back in 2020 and 21, and we were all had a lot of fears. All of our fears came up. And um, so I just want to, you know, encourage you and say, uh, don't live in fear. God hasn't called us to have a spirit of fear, but a spirit of strength and love and peace and hope. And so, if there's things that you want to accomplish, things you want to do, or things that you're scared to do, or things that you can't do, I just want you to know it's not true. And so let's let go of that story. Let's step into it, decide, commit, succeed, and let go of my God and my I love you. Stronger together. My life, soul, follow me more, and I'll see you soon.